This is JD with Hornbeak Network News and we got a chance to visit the open house at Black Oak Elementary Tuesday night as the parents got a chance to meet the teachers and view the children's classrooms. For those of you that didn't get to go, the teachers have done a fantastic job of decorating the classrooms with students work. As I walked the halls, I was met with smiling faces from every teacher excited at the prospect of meeting the arriving parents. Meanwhile, students were having a blast on their own navigating through several massive inflatable obstacle courses. We were also treated to a special interview with Coach Moffitt, who updated us on the Eagles' undefeated football season. So excited about this year. We've got uh, a strong team. We're low in numbers, but we have a good group of eighth graders who are ready to work hard. We actually won our first ball game this past week as we hosted Fulton City, and we had a come from behind win to win eight to six on a long touchdown run by Zach Jones, and we were just so excited about that. Uh, this week we're going to be playing Gibson County. That's here in Hornbeak at 5:30, and we're excited about that as uh, we've got some guys who have been working extremely hard over the summer and we're just ready to see the benefits of that hard work as we look to slug it out with Gibson County and it's going to be exciting so come on out catch the game we'd love to see you there thanks coach Moffitt compelling and rich if you remember our news story from last week Black Oak is now offering after-school care until 5 o'clock in the afternoon over 50 students are currently taking advantage of this program, which offers study time, snacks, and physical activity, all free of charge. All in all, the open house was a complete success as parents and teachers got a chance to connect, and we got a bright outlook on this year at Black Oak. That's all for us here at HNN. Small town, big stories. Good night, Hornbeak.